Uh, no doubt about the game of the day in League Two. Uh, first place, second. More on the leaders, Chesterfield, very shortly. Uh, but first, Scunthorpe United, who sacked their manager earlier this season and have never looked back since. They've been looking forward to this one all week. Second place, Scunthorpe, welcome table-topping Chesterfield today. The Irons are unbeaten in 13 games, and manager Russ Wilcox must take much credit since stepping up from assistance to Brian Laws. It's really pleasing for us as a football club. You know, we've not had a promotion push since 09 when Nigel was here. Um, you know, there's been difficult times in between. Um, so it's, uh, it's important that as, as a club, as a town, as players, as, as supporters and staff that we embrace this moment. I really enjoyed working under Brian, um, but as ruthless as football is, he, you know, the chairman thought it was right for him to, to have a change, so, you know, and Russ has come in and, and been fantastic. Um, I think his, his man management skills are very good, uh, his training's fantastic, so, you know, I think everyone's kind of um, blossoming. Striker Sam Winnell's move from Wolves has paid dividends. His 14 goals have been a key reason for their success. Disappointed to leave uh, my hometown club, um, but you know it's, it, I needed to move forward personally, and, and coming here was was a great move for me. Thankfully, like Brian and the chairman and the club took a took a gamble on me, um, and it's it's paid off to a degree. I'm enjoying my football more than I have in a very long time. Um, I enjoy this place and I enjoy being around the lads, so it's it's fantastic. He's got a long way to go. He's got a lot of things to learn. He, he's not the finished article. You know, Brian brought him in in the summer from uh, release from Wolves, and he's he's done terrifically well. But uh, we always work on the group. You know, it's not about individuals; it's, it's always about the group, how we perform as a group. And uh, at the moment, uh, the group's been outstanding. I think I've had a definitely had a heads up with, with knowing the players, you know, and knowing what makes them tick and what doesn't make them tick. You know, sometimes a new manager comes in, and it takes a couple of months for for them to adapt to the new players, to to what they see. Um, I've certainly had a head start regarding that and that's, uh, that's certainly helped me and, and helped the group. They've already seen off some top sides at Glanford Park this season. Another scalp today would be the best of the lot.